It is a special day for the folks at Plantronics. The headset maker is celebrating its 50th anniversary today. CEO Ken Conopan is, is uh, marking the occasion, sorry, Conopan is marking the occasion at the New York Stock Exchange where he joins us live now. Ken, welcome to Street Smart. Thanks for joining us. Congratulations. Thanks for having me. Uh, let me ask you about uh, the 50th anniversary, obviously a huge milestone. Where do you see the company going from here? Because things in communication have changed so much. Uh, your headsets have been used for a lot of operational uh, things on airfields and so forth. But now I would assume you're headed more in the direction of, of PC phones for, for companies. Yeah, well, you know, you're right. I mean, you don't get to 50 years as a technology company if you can't adapt to new opportunities. And right now, one of the best opportunities we've got in our history is the opportunity for unified communications. Because in office communications, people are starting to use the PC more and more for voice communication. They're doing desktop conferencing, video conferencing, and other applications. And that's great for us because those don't have a handset attached. So we're able to significantly expand our market opportunity. Do you see a move at corporations to go o over uh, internet, voice over internet protocol rather than using regular old telephones? Absolutely. Again, that's uh, part and parcel of unified communications. When you're on the computer, you, it's natural to be able to, to do more VoIP calls. So you see Microsoft Link, for example, being rolled out, which is uh, very much being used for VoIP calls. You see applications like Skype being used both by individuals as well as small business, already 20% of transatlantic uh, volume in business. And so that's a great opportunity for us, and it's a great cost savings for businesses. And you see a lot of the other established vendors putting more VoIP into hard phones as well as into soft clients as well, such as Cisco and Avaya. Let me ask you about earnings here. You know, uh, I see that you raised your long-term target uh, objectives for gross and operating margins, and still some analysts are saying kind of a weak forecast. How do you answer that? Well, I think that, you know, there's fundamental trends, which is really what we're playing in. Uh, we're dealing with secular growth, recovering economies, much faster uh, uh, pace in the emerging markets, and a huge opportunity in front of us. That doesn't mean the economy's not still a little bit choppy. So if you're playing a long-term opportunity, we've got that right in front of us. Any moment in time, of course, you can always see fluctuations. And the share price must look cheap to you. I see you've just authorized a 7 million share buyback. We did. I mean, our, our board has been returning hundreds of millions of dollars to shareholders in buybacks and in dividends, and we continue to think that we're very attractively uh, valued relative to our opportunities. With this huge opportunity right in front of us right now, uh, we thought that the uh, return on investment and the P-E ratio of the company was very low, making it very accretive to our earnings per share to buy stock. Where do you see the best opportunities for growth here, Ken, as far as uh, regions are concerned? I'm sorry, I couldn't quite hear you. Where do you see the best opportunities for growth? We're talking about U.S. economy here versus Europe versus Asia. Where do you see the best opportunity sure. for growth for your products? Well, so for, for some time, you know, we've had the highest growth rates, of course, in the emerging markets just because GDP is very fast and it's cutting across all sectors of our economy, including, uh, you know, contact center and on into unified communications. But having said that, unified communications is just a singularly extraordinary and global phenomenon as companies move from traditional phones onto those PC platforms using VoIP more and more and the fundamental opportunity we have to sell headsets because there is no no built-in handset on those PC platforms is extraordinary and is global. Ken, thanks so much for jo joining us. Ken Conapon there, the CEO of Plantronics, Thank you for having me. celebrating his 50th anniversary on the New York Stock Exchange.